we go, as you can see in this video, the class layouter for the student and exclusively adapted with air conditioning with can be reach more than 50 paxes in one time. The classroom complete adapted with LCD and equipped with enhance of automation control system. Marine engineering workshops are equipped with various auxiliaries and machinery that follow the standards and regulations set by the Marine Department and comply with the standards of the Ministry of Higher Education. Such meticulous tidiness and arrangements have been made by those experienced in the shipping industry. It consists of marine diesel engine which is two-stroke and four-stroke. There is also a marine diesel alternator engine that makes it easier for future marine engineers to understand and learn the science of marine engineering. There is also a diesel engine provided for students to learn the correct technique in the process of overhaul, assembling and box back the machinery according to the method and the correct as practiced on board. In this workshop, there are also small-scale models to make it easier for students to understand the correct concepts and procedures in understanding each machinery taught. There are also cross-sections of diesel engine and machinery models that have been displayed on the sidewalk must facilitate and help students to better understand in the subject studied. Cylinder liner, crankshaft assembly, cylinder head two-stroke and four-stroke, stuffing box, turbocharger arrangement are also on display and students will also make maintenance according to the learning syllabus each semester.
Generators on board ships are the power suppliers for the entire vessel as they stand as the primary source of power to all running machineries including the propulsion plant. For this reason, safe and efficient running of the ship generator has to be given highest consideration. Student might be able to operate and make some adjustment as per instructed by their trainers. The workshop also equipped with dead machinery and life machinery of access link control application parts separated which are dimensioned and create by Alpha Laval. Student may be able to operate and doing for maintenance as per syllabus and instructed by their trainers. ALCAP separators are used for purifying oil of specific gravity more than zero. 991. When oil is fed into the system through the oil Fresh water generator, one of the important machinery on board a ship, is something that cannot be done without. Fresh water produced from fresh water generator is used for drinking, cooking, washing and even running other important machinery which use fresh water as a cooling medium. Turbine is a rotary mechanical device that extracts the potential energy and kinetic energy of fluids and convert into mechanical energy. It is a prime mover which transforms the energy of working fluid into mechanical energy of turbine shaft. Boiler is a pressure vessel used on ships in which the water is heated to evaporate and generate the steam and the unit is so arranged that the generated steam accumulated in it. The two main types are water tube and fire tube. The student might be able to do maintenance as per syllabus layout and fully monitor by their trainers. At the sidewalk of the workshop, there are also small-scale models for propeller arrangements that make it easier for students to understand the function and see more clearly the mechanics found on the propeller. As we know, various pumps and many functions are available on board. There are various types of marine pumps available in the workshop such as positive displacement pump and rotary pump. It consists of gear pumps, centrifugal pumps, piston pumps and reciprocating pump. Students will perform maintenance on the pump. Each work in the workshop performed by the students will be evaluated in terms of neatness of the work, thoroughness in the selection of the right tools and applying safety features while doing the work. It is used to supply highly pressurized air to start main and secondary engines. Air compressor has an air storage bottle which stores the pressurized air. 
There are available different capacity main air compressors, but this capacity should be adequate for starting the main engine. Student also may be able to do work on this machineries and fully monitor by their trainers. Valves are also existence in this workshop. It consists of various types of valves found on board ship. Student also can do maintenance on this equipment such as lapping the valve seat, do overhaul and rectify the valve's leaks. Ships need valves to regulate the pressure and flow of fluids in the various onboard systems. Along with liquids, valves can also transfer gases, vapors, and slurries or semi-liquid mixtures. Each type of valve serves a different purpose, control direction of flow, regulate flow or pressure. Bench fittings are the must syllabus need to be accomplished by the student. It will consist of the right way to operate lathe machine, fabricationize the project given by their trainers, knowing better the use of hand tools, machine tools, measuring equipment and the safety, method of using cutting tools such as fixed and portable cutting tools, method of using filing and tooth jaw principle working and many more which is in accordance to syllabus. Students also need to practice the good attitude during doing the works and maintain good housekeeping.
the workshop also equipped with a settling gas cutting, portable and fixed welding bay. It consists of 16 welding bay and equipped with welding set. The type of weldings are SMAW shielded metal arc welding which are commonly used on board ship. The welding sets are properly maintained by workshop technician in order to meet the safety requirement and for a long lasting use. By right, student will complete the various process and projects set by the trainers in accordance with syllabus standard. Student will expose with types of basic arc welding, the procedure handbook of arc welding and safety awareness should be practiced during operate the welding machine. To provide a better end process, alerts of fact may affect the project such as preparation of tools and specimens, process selection, electrode selection, the right way to set up the current and a method and skills of welding. The expert trainers may assist the student in order to achieve the highest standard of delivery in the particular matters arise. Now, we are set to the end of the session. Safety features are the most priority action taken in order to achieve zero incident and zero accident at workshop. The workshop are equipped on board with fire control safety plan, fire alarm system, and tripping system to enhance safety for electrical equipments. The workshop also implemented safety features for students and trainers. With the perfect PPE equipment such as safety helmets, safety shoes, chemical handling protective equipment, safety harness for working aloft and in the event of an accident, an emergency response team is also created to identify the cause of the accident and ensure it will not happen again. First aid. Emergency is also provided such as emergency eyewash station, it is important to provide a fast response in the event of an accident. Chain blocks in a frame are commonly used to lift up a heavy equipment and had been tested regularly the SWL. All chemicals and hazardous liquid may place at chemical stores, and so is the paint also properly stored at paint stores and only authorized person may regularly maintain this equipment. Hope you will enjoy the video and get alerts of information through this video. Feel free to subscribe, like and share this video. My name is Elsa. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.